I assumed that I'm going to play on a good team all the time. We're going to go to the conference finals or the finals. And I went to the conference finals, I, I forget, three or four times, and I only made it to the finals once. And when you have a chance to win, I, I take that, like I always, when I'm watching this, if you have a legitimate chance to win the championship, I mean a legitimate chance, you have to it, it, uh, hold on to that season and like come together as a team because it's very rare that you're good enough to actually win a championship. And I always tell people, basketball to me is the hardest sport to win a championship. When you win a championship in basketball, you really are the best team. That's the first time I ever said to myself, no, not first time, but since I had become a great player, that was the first time I ever said to myself, that guy's better than me. Because no disrespect to Magic Johnson, I thought he had more help. No disrespect to Larry Bird, I thought they had more help. I, Cause the, 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 the one thing that Phoenix proved to me was, if I get some help, I'm good enough to make my team win. But that was the first time in my, in my life in a long time that I said, that guy's better than me. Sometimes I'm sitting around, I'll say to myself, I should have should have tried to score on those two guys. I, even if I screwed up, I would have felt better about myself screwing up instead of passing the ball. And that was your only trip to the finals. I know. Is that, I mean, sometimes you hear guys say, well, now you got that taste of it. Now you got that hunger. Yeah. And now you will not be stopped in getting back to the finals and winning that thing. You surprised you never got back? I mean, I, I'm very realistic. I, I'm only playing now for the championship. And if, and if I can look myself in the mirror and say, hey, man, my last couple years, I gave it the best shot that I possibly could. I can be at peace with that. He's a great, great player. He's a really good dude. I would ask him to go and talk to Magic Johnson, Michael Jordan, those guys who are great like him. Every person who's a star or who's famous or rich or whatever should always go talk to an older person who's been in that situation. You know, I always, when I speak to kids, I says, working hard doesn't guarantee you're going to be successful, but being lazy and not working hard guarantees you're gonna be a failure. But I think what you touched on earlier, man, they just got too many video games. You know, sitting around playing video games. Kids don't go out and play. You know, I, I, we went out and played every single day. I mean, you do your homework, uh, and then you go out and play. These kids today, they go home and they sit in their rooms in, in the cave and just play video games all the time.